How's your day been? How's your life been? How the fuck are you? I have a doctor's appointment today. Unpopular opinion. I'm probably gonna make a few of you mad. I think that in terms of Eugenia Cooney and Jeffree Star, I think personally that Jeffree Star, in his own way, is helping Eugenia. In his own way, but he can't make it too obvious because Eugenia will fuck him off like she did Jacqueline. I'm sorry, but bro, Jeffrey literally got Eugenia to put something in her mouth on live. She actually put a water bottle to her mouth and if she drank it, if she didn't, that's not the point, yeah? It's fucking baby steps. Baby steps. The fact that she even put a drink to her lips is incredible. And Jeffrey managed to do it in his own way. He's not taking this route that everyone else is taking, yeah? He's doing it differently. He's going about the different route. I personally believe that Jeffrey Star really reflected and he was like, okay, she didn't like this. She didn't like that. She cut them off because of this. I'm going to go about this in a different way, a different approach. I'm going to help her, but in a way in which is not obvious. You know what I mean? I know that some of the stuff that he has said, like the whole 5150 thing, I get it. It seems really cruel, yeah? And it seems horrible, but it's working. Bro, she put a bottle to her lips. You can like him, you can not like him. Maybe you don't like the approach he's taking, but it, she came like water. Have y'all gotten close to seeing her having a drink of water in a long time? Have you, normally, Eugenia, take a sip of water. Ah, uh, no guys, no thank you. I'm kind of like not doing that now, but she actually did. She did. His approach is working. It's different. It's very different. Maybe that, I don't know what the whole TikTok thing, he got her account brought back allegedly. Maybe he's done that because he's doing a different approach. He doesn't want to squish her. He doesn't want to silence her. He wants her to feel that she is in control because people with eating disorders commonly feel like they're not in control. I, I'm personally team Jeffrey. I think he's going around it a different way. My opinion. How's your day been? How's your life been? How the fuck are you? This is my part two to my Jeffree Star, Eugenia Cooney little um, TikTok I did before. I just forgot to mention this part. Look how cute that curl is though. Yeah, so I forgot to mention in that video, I saw a YouTube um, little episode thing, whatever, about Jeffree Star and Eugenia ship. Uh, <laughs> fucking Eugenia ship, yeah. That Jeffree... Why can't I say this? That there's a conservatorship going on between Jeffree Star and Eugenia Cooney. It was in a TikTok thing where Jeffree said it himself, uh, so I don't think I need to say allegedly. And that he's been delegating Eugenia to do certain things. She's under like his management. Um, like they planned, he said something like, okay, you've got three videos to do on this day, one TikTok video, one review. And then he said that um, Deb um, edited one of his videos or something like that. And he was, you know, talking highly of them, talking positively of them. And that's a good thing. I agree with that. That was a very, very smart move to make. Here's my reason why because it's giving Eugenia more control, you know? And I know that sounds weird. She's under management. So you'd think, well, no, she technically like lost a bit of control, like hello, conservatorship. But keep in mind, Eugenia is absolutely obsessed with Jeffrey, yeah? So when he tells her to do something, it's like it gives her a sense of purpose and that's her control. Her purpose is her control. She now has something to really, really look forward to. You know, that's in a way her taking control back from her life. You know what I mean? Sorry, am I shaking? My arm's getting tired. He's getting comfortable. He's getting good with Deb. And 
Have you never heard of that saying, you take down from within? Because that is exactly what you do in a situation like this. We all know what Deb's like, okay? We all know that. It's fucking surprising that Eugenia still has friends, you know, especially after how we've seen Deb being controlling. She can't even fucking look at the moon on her own. Like, she has a friend and someone that she really, really idolizes. Some say that it's a power dynamic, but they say it in a negative connotation. But in reality, there's nothing negative going on. He's taking down from within. He's literally going his own way to infiltrate, if that makes sense. But it can't look obvious. You guys saw how fucking Deb can, like spoke to Jacqueline. Well, we didn't, we didn't see it. We heard it. Whatever. We, we know that how Deb can be, all right? So why would Jeffrey take the approach of, you know, oh my God, you, you need to go to the ward. I'm really concerned about you. I really want the best for you. You need to, da, 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 da. Bro, he'd be kicked out of their lives so fucking fast. Jeffrey, for all we know, could be the one that is actually saving her life, yeah? All these approaches don't work. Getting her help doesn't work. She doesn't want it, yeah? So instead of thinking, how can we get her institutionalized? How can we get her off social media? How can we ban her, yeah? No, that's not the right mindset to have. The mindset is that she needs to change within herself. She needs to need something to look forward to. She needs to, you know, see that, oh my God, life is going so good. I don't want it to end. I want to stay here. I want to stay working with Jeffrey. I now have a purpose and it's with someone I absolutely idolize. I want to live now, you know? Because everyone also says, okay, th there's arguments, yeah? Okay, she gets institutionalized and then she's just going to like relapse again. No shit. Because she doesn't want the change. That's the point. That's why it's a smart different approach. He's not telling her to go get institutionalized. Yeah, he's seeing her as a person. Yeah, he makes those inappropriate jokes. Yeah, but that's fucking Jeffrey, okay? Okay? Jeffrey fucking roasts all of his friends, I'm pretty fucking sure. That's his sense of humor. Yeah, it's, some of you might think it's fucked up. I think it's hilarious. But um, yeah, of course she's going to relapse. She doesn't want it. Jeffrey Star is giving her purpose. Jeffree Star is literally like, he's not focusing on, on that shit. Like, that's why he's going along with it. Like, yeah, she's fine. Yeah, yeah, all of this. He's agreeing with her to be on her fucking side. So that way she can have that epiphany that this relationship can keep blossoming and blooming. And you know what I mean? It gives a sense of purpose. If you want change, yeah, identify the problem. And the problem in this is that Eugenia doesn't want to live, okay? She doesn't want to. And Jeffrey is giving her a reason to. Team fucking Jeffrey.